What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Hicker Scuba Marina. I'm gonna show you what our day consisted of today. Um, if you're a history buff out here, or if you're anything like me, then you'll understand the importance to the dives that we make, and especially the dives we made today. Here on our local lake, there's several bridges that cross over from either Alexander County into Catawba County, or from Caldwell County into Catawba County. And there's a lot of rich history here in the lake, one of our favorite dive sites is the old Hickory Highway Bridge prior to what we call the 127 Bridge, which goes from Bethlehem into the city of Hickory, or from Alexander County to Catawba County. And even prior to um, the 127 Bridge we have today, there was another 127 Bridge prior to that. But even before that 127 Bridge, we had what was called the old Hickory Highway Bridge. And that was basically a horse and buggy bridge that came out after the original ferry service that went from Oliver's Landing, which is in Bethlehem, Alexander County, uh, into the city of Hickory, which is in Catawba County, and it went from uh, Oliver's Landing over to Moore's Ferry. And so the the ferry service, after they shut it down, they built the Hickory Highway Bridge, which once again goes from Bethlehem into Hickory or Alexander County into Catawba County. And then several years after that, they, they blasted it out and they built the original 127 bridge, uh, which then they ended up blowing it up and, and building the current 127 bridge we got now. But what we're going to show you in the video here is the uh, bridge columns from the old hickory highway bridge or the old horse and buggy bridge and we use this as a dive site now what we actually did this morning is we cut or uh tied a rope around one of the main bridge pillars that are still underwater it's in about 40 foot of water we tied a rope around it and brought it over to a point of land so that whenever we bring divers out we don't want to waste a lot of time in the morning re sonar and re trying to relocate this bridge pillar to send divers on because this is a good place it's, it works as a natural platform for us to do uh skills with students but it's also a great place to spearfish there's a lot of ton of huge catfish on this platform so what we did is tied a rope around it today run it over to a point of land so now anytime we take students out we can anchor our boat up at that point of land follow that rope straight down to the platform and we don't have to waste a lot of time trying to locate the uh the old bridge pillars that are still underwater so enjoy the video guys and if you're a history buff out there i, I hope you understand the importance of why we make these dives here in our local lake so enjoy the video
All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, that is the old original uh, horse and buggy bridge that crossed over from Alexander County, which is or Bethlehem in Alexander County, over to the city of Hickory, which is in Catawba County. Um, and a lot of rich, rich history there, you know, right after the ferry service shut down they built that bridge and of course they blew that bridge up and they built the 127 bridge and then of course they blew up the 127 bridge and we have the current 127 bridge uh and for the ones out there that know anything about our area they're probably fixing to blow up this current 127 bridge and build another one too at least we hoping they are because the current one's about ready to fall in but um Guys, I appreciate you watching this video. If you're a diver, check out your local environment. You don't always have to go on a tropical uh, vacation just to find some awesome diving in your area. Uh, I'm going to also give a shout out to Atlantic Mapping Company. And Atlantic Mapping Company, they make topo maps that are GPS maps. And you can take that GPS map and find all different types of coordinates of local environments. And a lot of times they will show you things that are already under the water they'll give you the gps coordinates and you can go and explore them uh, i know on our lake there's i think two or three hundred points of references on the atlantic map or atlantic mapping company's version of their topo map of our lake that you can actually just go out and explore uh plenty of bridges out there that you can explore there's old houses or foundations the houses out here of course if you dive in the south carolina area you got joe cassie and kiwi there's grave sites and graveyards in there so there's a lot of great local diving in your environment that i think a lot of times divers don't think of when we think of scuba diving it's always tropical warm water um crystal clear water but we neglect to think about our local environments where there's a lot of good diving so once again guys i appreciate you coming along on this dive i hope you enjoyed this video if you got any questions simply put it down in the comment section below we'll be happy to answer it in any way that we can but guys as always make sure you follow us on instagram and twitter like us on facebook pin us on pinterest subscribe to us here on youtube and as always guys we appreciate your business